Monkeys see pretty space rocks floating in cosmic soup. Mercury shiny, like banana peel. Venus yellow, like ripe fruit. Mars red, like monkey's bottom when angry. Monkey think, ooh, space vacation time. Pack bananas and go explore. But monkey very, very wrong. These space rocks not vacation spots. They cosmic murder machines designed to kill curious apes in most horrible ways monkey brain can imagine. Which planet turns monkey into crispy banana chips in five seconds? Which one crushes monkey flatter than stepped on ant? And which sneaky space rock turns monkey into sparkling diamonds before grinding monkey bones to cosmic dust? Monkey survived visiting every death planet in solar system. Now monkey warn other monkeys before they make same deadly mistake that almost turned monkey into space ghost. Mercury. First stop on monkey's deadly space tour, Mercury. Monkey think closest planet to sun means always toasty warm, like sitting by campfire with unlimited bananas. Monkey land on day side and immediately regret life choices. Mercury day side is 430 degrees Celsius, hot enough to melt lead. That's like sticking monkey in giant oven set to incinerate banana. Monkey's spacesuit starts cooking monkey like banana bread. After just two minutes, monkey feels like overcooked monkey jerky. Spacesuit cooling system screaming louder than howler monkey having bad day. But wait, Mercury has special surprise. No atmosphere means no protection from deadly space radiation. Mercury gets seven times more radiation than Earth. Monkey's DNA getting scrambled like eggs in blender, while monkey simultaneously gets roasted alive. Mercury day lasts 88 Earth days. That's 88 days of being slowly cooked by cosmic radiation oven. Monkey would become well done space jerky long before sunset. But Mercury is confused planet that can't make up mind. Night side drops to minus 180 degrees Celsius. Monkey goes from being roasted monkey to frozen monkey popsicle in cosmic freezer. Monkey's fingers go numb first, then toes. Then monkey starts shivering like leaf in hurricane. After 30 minutes, monkey's blood starts turning into slush. After 60 minutes, monkey becomes permanent ice sculpture on Mercury's dark side. Monkey's only hope? Terminator zone. Thin line between burning day and freezing night. But even then... Temperatures change faster than monkey's mood when banana supply runs low. Plus, still getting blasted by enough radiation to turn monkey into glowing space ghost. Mercury gives monkey exactly zero good options. All roads lead to dead monkey. Venus. Next stop, Venus. Monkey see pretty yellow planet and think, ooh, Earth's twin sister. Must be nice place for monkey vacation. Venus looks so beautiful from space like giant golden banana floating in cosmic soup. Monkey excited to explore Earth's sister planet. What could go wrong? Everything goes wrong. Moment Monkey's spaceship touches Venus atmosphere, pressure gauge goes crazy. Venus atmospheric pressure is 92 times stronger than Earth. That's like having 92 elephants sitting on Monkey's chest while Monkey tries to breathe. Monkey's spacesuit starts crumpling like empty banana peel. First, helmet visor cracks, then chest plate buckles. Monkey trapped inside imploding metal banana suit with nowhere to run. In next three seconds, Venus crushes monkey like stepping on ant. Monkey skin compresses, blood vessels pop like tiny balloons, organs squish together like mashed bananas. Monkey loses consciousness as body becomes monkey pancake. But Venus not done torturing monkey yet. Planet surface is 450 degrees Celsius, almost hot as Earth's lava. Even if monkey somehow survives being pancaked, Venus cooks monkey from inside out like microwave banana. Remember those pretty yellow clouds monkey admired? Surprise! Made of concentrated sulfuric acid. Same stuff that dissolves car batteries. Like invisible acid rain that melts monkey's face off while monkey screams. Venus atmosphere is 96% carbon dioxide. That's like trying to breathe inside car exhaust pipe. Even if monkey survives crushing, cooking, and acid melting, Monkey still suffocates on poisonous air. Venus gives monkey exactly five seconds of hope before turning monkey into flat, cooked, acid-burned, suffocated monkey remains. Venus is cosmic liar that promises paradise but delivers only death. Venus, beautiful from distance, absolutely murderous up close. Mars. Next up, Mars. Red planet that looks friendly compared to Mercury's radiation oven and Venus's crushing acid nightmare. Monkey think, finally, 
planet that won't immediately try to murder monkey. Mars daytime temperatures reach nice 20 degrees Celsius, like perfect banana eating weather. Monkey can actually walk around without being instantly cooked or frozen. Monkey feeling optimistic for first time since leaving Earth. Mars has cool red rocks and interesting craters. Monkey think maybe monkey can build nice monkey colony here, grow space bananas, live happily ever after. Mars is sneaky liar planet. Mars atmosphere thinner than monkey's patience when banana supply runs low. Atmospheric pressure only 0.6% of Earth's. That's like trying to breathe on top of mountain, three times taller than Mount Everest. One microscopic hole in spacesuit, smaller than banana seed, and monkey starts dying horrible death. Mars atmosphere mostly carbon dioxide with almost no oxygen, like trying to breathe car exhaust fumes. As spacesuit loses pressure, gases in monkey's blood starts boiling. Monkey's skin puffs up like balloon animal. Monkey saliva bubbles on tongue. Eyeballs start bulging out of skull like cartoon character. Monkey gasping for oxygen that doesn't exist. After 15 seconds, monkey loses consciousness. After two minutes, monkey's brain starts dying from oxygen starvation. After seven minutes, monkey becomes permanent Mars decoration. But Mars saves most evil trick for last, dust storms. These storms cover entire planet for months at time like being trapped inside cosmic vacuum cleaner bag filled with razor-sharp sand. Mars dust particles finer than flour, but sharp like tiny glass shards. Dust gets everywhere, in air filter, equipment, joints, spacesuit seams, like having sand in banana sandwich, except sand wants to kill monkey. Dust scratches spacesuit from inside, clogs air filters until monkey can't breathe, damages heating system until monkey start freezing, Monkey watches helplessly as life support system fail one by one. Mars give monkey beautiful false hope, then slowly murder monkey while making monkey watch. Monkey dies knowing that red planet is cosmic tease that promise paradise but deliver only slow, dusty death. Mars, close enough to seem friendly, deadly enough to crush monkey dreams like stepping on rotten banana. Jupiter. Next stop, Jupiter. Biggest bully in solar system playground. Planet so massive, it could eat 1,300 Earths for breakfast and still be hungry for more bananas. Jupiter is gas giant with no solid ground to land on. Just endless falling through poison clouds until monkey becomes cosmic soup. Monkey starting to think this whole space exploration thing was terrible idea. Jupiter gravity 2.4 times stronger than Earth. Monkey feels like carrying two extra monkeys on back while falling toward cosmic death trap. Monkey's bones creaking under pressure before even entering atmosphere. First layer, white clouds made of frozen ammonia crystals. Temperature drops to minus 150 degrees Celsius, like falling through cosmic freezer filled with poisonous snow that wants to freeze monkey's eyeball solid. Winds here reach 360 kilometers per hour, fast enough to blow monkey to a different galaxy. Monkey's capsule getting tossed around like banana in blender. Monkey's stomach doing backflips while monkey tries not to vomit in space helmet. But Jupiter saves worse surprise for deeper layers. Static electricity building up around monkey's capsule. Atmosphere becomes highly charged like cosmic battery ready to explode. Then lightning strikes. Jupiter lightning bolts carry enough energy to power entire monkey civilization for a year. When lightning hits monkey's capsule, electrical systems don't just fail, they explode. Oxygen supply fails. Heating system dies. Navigation computers fry like overcooked bananas. Monkey trapped in powerless metal coffin, falling through toxic storm clouds toward certain doom. As monkey falls deeper into Jupiter's belly, pressure increases to 100 million times Earth's pressure. That's like having weight of entire mountain rain sitting on monkey's chest while monkey tries to breathe. Eventually, monkey reaches layer where hydrogen becomes liquid metal. Monkey not falling through gas anymore. Monkey swimming through cosmic quicksand made of metallic soup that traps monkey forever. If monkey somehow survives to Jupiter's core, temperature reaches 24,000 degrees Celsius. That's four times hotter than sun's surface. Monkey doesn't just die. Monkey becomes scattered atoms floating in cosmic furnace. Jupiter doesn't kill monkey. Jupiter erases monkey from existence. Monkey becomes part of gas giant's endless storm, forever spinning in cosmic hurricane with no beginning and no end. Jupiter, so big it has its own weather system, so deadly it turns visiting monkeys into atomic particles. Next stop, Saturn. 
most beautiful planet in solar system with gorgeous rings that look like cosmic jewelry. Monkey think, finally, pretty planet that look friendly and majestic. Saturn rings so beautiful, they make monkey hearts sing. Sparkling ice crystals catching sunlight like millions of tiny diamonds floating in perfect circles. Monkey think, this must be paradise. Saturn is cosmic trap disguised as jewelry store. Those pretty rings, made of billions of ice chunks and rocks ranging from tiny pebbles to house-sized boulders, like beautiful necklace made of flying death missile. Ring particle moving at 70,000 km per hour. That's fast enough to circle entire Earth in 36 minutes. Like being shot at by cosmic machine gun, firing house-sized bullets at impossible speed. Monkey tries to navigate through rings, but get bombarded by ice chunks moving faster than bullet. Each impact sounds like cosmic thunder. Spaceship hull cracking like eggshell under hammer blows. Then monkey sees it. Ice boulder size of monkey's entire village, heading straight for spaceship. No time to dodge, no place to hide. Just cosmic bowling ball about to strike monkey spacecraft. Crash. Spaceship gets smashed like banana hit by sledgehammer. Monkey spinning out of control towards Saturn atmosphere, leaving trail of debris and broken monkey dreams. If ring debris doesn't kill monkey, Saturn atmosphere finishing job. Hurricane winds blasting at 1800 km per hour, fast enough to blow monkey to a different solar system. At Saturn, North Pole, sits permanent storm so big that two Earths could fit inside it. Storm been raging for million of years with no sign of stopping. Monkey get caught in external cosmic tornado that never end. Inside storm, monkey get tossed around like banana in cosmic blender. Up, down, sideway, upside down. Monkey doesn't know which way is which. Monkey's brain getting scrambled while storm winds tear capsule apart piece by piece. As monkey fall deep into Saturn belly, pressure turns hydrogen gas into liquid metal. Monkey not falling through air anymore. Monkey drowning in metallic soup that conducts electricity and crushes everything. Saturn core reaches 11,700 degrees Celsius, twice as hot as sun's surface. Monkey doesn't just burn, monkey become vaporized ape atoms scattered through metallic hydrogen ocean. Saturn trick monkey with beautiful atmosphere, then murder monkey with cosmic jewelry box full of flying death rocks. Monkey become part of Saturn's eternal storm, forever, spinning in majestic death trap. Saturn, most beautiful way to die in solar system. Most painful way to learn that pretty thing in space want to kill monkey. Ice Giants Next stop, Uranus. Ice giant that spin on its side like cosmic bowling ball that got knocked over. Planet so weird it can't even rotate properly. Monkey think, at least this one look calm and blue. Uranus only planet in solar system that spin sideway. Like someone kicked cosmic soccer ball so hard it forgot which way is up. Uranus day last only 17 Earth hour, so planet spinning faster than monkey's head after eating fermented banana. Uranus is coldest planet in entire solar system. Temperature drop to minus 224 degrees Celsius. That's cold enough to freeze monkey's thoughts before monkey can think them. Monkey's breath would turn into ice crystal before leaving monkey's mouth. Uranus atmosphere contain 2% methane gas. That might sound small, but concentrated enough to kill monkey in minutes. Like breathing cosmic fart gas that dissolves monkey's lungs from inside out. As monkey falls deeper, gets pelted by ice pellets moving at 900 km per hour, like being inside cosmic hailstorm where each hailstone size of monkey's fist and hard as rock, spaceship hull getting dented like banana peel hit by hammer. But Uranus a special surprise for visiting monkeys. If monkey survive toxic gas, freezing cold, and ice pellet bombardment, monkey falls 10,000 km deeper into planet's belly where magic happen. At this depth, pressure becomes so intense and temperature so high that carbon atoms get squeezed into diamonds. Since monkey body is 18% carbon, monkey about to undergo most expensive transformation in cosmic history. Monkey's carbon atom start crystallizing into precious gems. Monkey's bones become diamond bones. Monkey teeth become diamond teeth. Even monkey's fingernails become sparkling diamond fingernails. For a brief moment, monkey become most valuable creature in solar system. Living diamond monkey worth more than entire Earth's economy. Monkey sparkles like cosmic jewelry box. Then pressure crushes diamond monkey into cosmic dust. Even diamonds can't survive Uranus crushing embrace. Monkey becomes sparkling diamond powder scattered through ice giant's metallic core. Neptune is Uranus' twin brother but angrier. 
Same diamond making process, same toxic atmosphere, same bone crushing pressure. But Neptune has one thing that Uranus does not have. Supersonic winds reaching 2100 km per hour. That's faster than speed of sound. Neptune winds so fast they break sound barrier while tearing monkey apart. Neptune wind creates spinning vortexes that subject monkey to 10 g-forces. That means monkey feels like weighing 10 times normal weight. Monkey's organs get compressed like grapes in wine press while blood pools in legs. Monkey loses consciousness in 30 seconds and brain gets starved of oxygen. After 5 minutes, both spaceship and monkey's body lose structural integrity completely. Monkey get disintegrated into Neptune's atmosphere, becoming part of supersonic wind system that will blow monkey's atoms around planet for millions of years. Ice giants don't just kill monkey, they turn monkey into precious gem first, then scatter monkey's diamond remains across cosmic storms that never end. Most expensive way to die in entire solar system. Uranus and Neptune, where monkey becomes priceless before becoming worthless. Universe is not monkey friendly place. Space is beautiful cosmic death trap designed to murder curious apes in most horrible ways monkey brain can imagine. Every planet agrees on one thing. Visiting monkeys must die. After surviving cosmic tour of death planets, monkey sees Earth with new eyes. Beautiful blue marble with breathable air, reasonable pressure, and temperatures that don't immediately kill monkey. Space is for looking at from safe distance while eating bananas on planet that actually wants monkey to stay alive. You also need to see Monkey explain black holes in Monkey language. Trust Monkey, black holes make these planet look like friendly vacation spot.